Hey everybody, this is Nate. You're watching WASD20. Welcome back today for a little review of a dice bag. This is the reinforced velvet dice bag from Norse Foundry. And um, I've got it heavily laden with other Norse Foundry goodies, but I wanted to do a separate review of the dice bag here because I think it is a pretty decent product. If you haven't already seen it, I recommend you check out my review of the seven RPG metal dice set that they sent me as well. But anyway, let's get down to it and take a closer look at this dice bag. So here we have it. This is the reinforced velvet dice bag from Norse Foundry. Uh, these retail for $6 on NorseFoundry.com or you can get them on Amazon for $7. So check out both links in the description down below. This one is the brown with uh, black interior and it is velvet exterior with a treated satin on the inside. And uh, that's one of the things I really liked about it that I wasn't uh, really expecting is that treated satin is really nice, uh, very smooth, and uh, it gives the whole bag a really nice stiffness that, um, yeah, I just wasn't really expecting. So it seems really durable. Um, if, we, if we compare to the standard dice bag that I have bought at a gaming shop and I see a lot of these it just feels really flimsy by comparison and uh, it does not have that uh, liner and that's one of the big differences here and I think the price is pretty comparable I think that um, this was probably at least six dollars too at a uh, at one of my favorite game shops so I've used this in the past but I'm gonna probably be ditching it and uh, taking a step up to the uh, Norse foundry dice bag here. Now they also have some pretty awesome looking uh, leather dice bags which I would be very interested in checking out. Uh, this one was only six dollars. I think that the uh, leather dice bags are something like 35. Uh, yeah it looks like 30 to 35 dollars depending on the options. Uh, but anyway this is a very nice one. I'm really happy with it. They also come in some really cool uh, color combinations like blue with yellow interior or black with red interior and uh, lots of other options. So it's nothing super fancy. Um, it's not like the type of thing that I would say, oh, you got to go out of your way to get this dice bag. But if you happen to be ordering some products from NorseFoundry.com and you're in need of a cheap dice bag, um, I would definitely recommend you check it out. Um, the I should also note that the drawstrings uh, do pull tight and seem to hold pretty well so that I would have no fear of uh, traveling with this thing and having uh, dice come out. Uh, I think it would be totally fine. So yeah, that's it for this one. Let me know if you have any questions down in the comments below and uh, check these little guys out at NorseFoundry.com. Alright, take care everybody.